What's happening, Yak in Texas? It's Ty again. Hey, I'm here to talk about the new Contour and some of the pluses and minuses of it versus GoPros and the Play Sport. If you watch my kayak fishing show 30 miles out, an abundance of the first few years was sh of the show was shot with this Kodak Play Sport. I've been through about four of them. You can see I've tore tear them up, man. I look, I broke off the tripod thing in here. Uh, this one film's funky now. It has a weird color to it. I don't know what happened, but I just bang them up. I think I'm on my fourth place for it, and they're hard to find now. Um, so I started going to the Samsungs, which is similar. But now, after only having this one less than a year, when I press the power button, it's really hard to get it to go on. So I'm already having trouble with this, and it's micro SD, which I don't like micro, because they're small and you lose them. And, but everybody's going to micro, so what do you do? Anyway, the GoPros. This is a buddy of mine. I have an old one. This is the new black. The problem with the GoPros is the casing makes the audio just uh, real muffled and it doesn't sound very good. So I just suffer through it and I cut back to the Play Sport because the Play Sport has killer audio. And the, and the picture is very good. So I would always really lean on the Play Sport with some cutaways with the GoPro. But now somebody's made something in between. It's called, bam, the Contour. You have the audio of a play sport. You still get the waterproof down a few meters like a play sport. But you get the, the uh, wide angle of the GoPro. So the contour is something that came out. It's new and it's in the middle. A lot of people mount them to guns. That's what these slits are for. You can mount them any which way and then spin this to correct to correct it. The gun, if it's mounted like this on a gun, you spin the lens and it writes it. makes it right up, the view right side up. So the Contour is a neat camera, plus it's got just one big slider. You kick it on, and it's rocking. Now for me personally, I don't like viewfinders on the back. When I'm in the field, I'm filming. When I'm home, I'll look at the footage. I just want a big button I can push, and it's rolling. And that's what I get with the Contour. Uh, these things, oh, who cares about that, man? They're, you know, that thing's six months, and it's busted already. These I love, but I'm on my fourth one. GoPros are killer, but muffled audio, contour, right in the middle. Good audio, good wide-angle lens, come in at about 200 bucks. They make one that's about 400 bucks. a contour that comes in a case. It goes down 80 feet like the GoPro. You can use your, your phone to uh, control it and all that stuff. I don't need all that. I just need to fish and film. So, I like the contour. 200 bucks can't beat it. It's a halfway mark between the GoPro and the Play Sport. Till next time, I'm Ty. Go check out my kayak fishing show 30 Miles Out at 30milesout.com. Like me on Facebook at 30 Miles Out Facebook, and we'll catch you next time. What?